WFNN. Headline News Update. Good afternoon, folks. Steve Rhodes coming to you live from the shores of sunny Delray Beach, Florida. This is your 2 p.m. update. Currently, we have all the U.S. indices trading to the downside. The Dow's off 107 points. The S&P 32. NASDAQ 100, 143. Russell's off 31. Semi's down 52. Trend is off 52 as well. You've got gold trading out at 1948. That's off 7 bucks. Silver down 65 cents, 2.5%. 2461 is the print there. Lights recruit up 79 cents, trading out at 102.97. Let's take a, a couple of moments here go take a look at the NQ charts, our multi-panel set of charts, looking at uh, some real short-term time frames. And what we're going to see is that we don't have any bottom signals as we speak right now. Five-minute time frame chart, no bottom signal there. Uh, you do have wave number seven, that's letter G. You've got to have a higher low on the 10-minute chart out there, so potential signal. The 15-minute chart is getting into bar number eight. That says over the course of the next uh, half hour, 45 minutes, that could generate a bouncing signal or bottoming signal. Same thing for the 30-minute chart. Now, when I say same thing, you've got a, uh, it's in bar number eight right now, so that doesn't complete till 2.30, nine at uh, three o'clock, so it wouldn't be till 3.30. So that's a, just suggestion, 30-minute chart for the NQ. You might have some kind of uh, relief rally going Going into the close. So I pay attention to that 30 minute time frame chart for those of you that are short. I might want to uh, consider taking your profits, maybe, maybe not. But I would focus on the 30-minute chart here for the NQ. The daily chart, which is right above that in the sharp left-hand corner, is testing that key area of support. That is its TD9 count threshold bottom at 13,876.50. You close below that, you're at 13,845 right now. That's going to suggest to move to 13,417. Let's spend a few minutes, take a look at our indice chart, see what kind of signals they're providing us, if anything. In the upper left-hand chart, you've got the uh, Dow. The Dow just simply has tested and rejected projected its breakdown level of 35201 can't bust it up try to bust it down 34 735 or so would be its price target in the case of the S&P 500 its price target to the downside is 483124 you close below that 4251 becomes the price target the NDX a close below 13884 which you're trading below right now would suggest to move to 13475 the semis the suggestion there is getting back to the 3030 level the New York Stock Exchange that is kind of crucial as we speak right now. Price sitting at its oscillator unchanged line. Folks, stay tuned to your favorite polar bear. David White's up next. Have a terrific Thursday. I'll look forward to seeing you tomorrow on Fantastic Friday.